Costa Rica. We have driven about five hours to the north west coast to a small town called Tamarindo. We've come here because it's one of the most popular areas of Costa Rica. It's a really beautiful, kind of cute, very trendy kind of beach town. Uh, but today we're doing something that I don't think most people have done. We are going to be flying in an auto gyro, auto gyro. We're gonna get the pronunciation <laughs> right. I have no idea, I've gone back and forth. It's like a helicopter because it's like a rotating propeller. It's not like a fixed wing aircraft, but it's like smaller and it just fits one person right behind the pilot. So we have to go one after another. It's supposed to be safe. I think it'll be nice views, but also like a little nervous. <laughs> I think we'll be fine. Let's go find out. Our pilot Angelo here has informed me that it is gyro, not euro. <laughs> so I feel like knowing the pronunciation is step one. But yeah, auto gyro. Here we go. You're gonna be sitting in the back. Yep. We don't want things to be flying away into the prop. <laughs> <laughs> For this reason, if you want to use your cell phone to take pictures, I'm gonna give you a pouch. And if you have a GoPro, just make sure that yep. it's nicely strapped onto your wrist and you're not gonna lose it. All right, time to hop on and fly. This is so much smaller than a helicopter. Like we've done doors off helicopters in the past where like you have one side, but this is like totally open air. <laughs> this is a little freaky. This thing is really small. And when I move the whole thing moves. Okay, bye-bye. Nice air, Holly. You get out the same thing as you came in. My hair is going to be like this for the next week. <laughs> Note to self, put your hair up before you do that. <laughs> it was so windy, but it was so cold. You get so close. It's kind of like a helicopter where you can like really get up along the coastline and love that. You're going you're gonna to love it. All right, have fun. <laughs> Dragonfly. <laughs> That's a really good analogy. Wow, never did I know that I would know exactly what it's like to be a dragonfly. A dragonfly. <laughs> That's right. It acted a lot like a helicopter, where like when you'd come up over and like the wind would change, it would kind of do that little like what they call a puppy dog tail wag. But otherwise, it was really nimble. You get really close to things, which I appreciated. Very similar, but different. Overall, definitely thought it might be a little sketchier than a helicopter, but I don't think it was. And I looked it up and apparently it needs a really, really small landing strip um, and it can't stall, it can't spin because it doesn't have fixed wings. And so it's actually one of the more safer aircrafts out there. Doesn't look it, but I give it an A+. <laughs> it's really fun. 